Now, first <coughs> alert weather with Chief Meteorologist Tom Messner. All right, everybody. Yeah, in addition to having a, uh, you know, really sticky day <laughs> around here, we've got some showers, not too much in the way of thunderstorms right now. We did have some storms that came up through northern New York, especially in Franklin County, have gone over the border and not really much of a bother for us right now. But we are keeping an eye on what's going on right here. I'm not seeing a lot of lightning with these, uh, well, with this line here, but it is going to rain in places like Plattsburgh and down toward Peru and then point south, say down into Westport. I think that's going to happen certainly within the hour here and then over Lake Champlain it goes and beyond from there. So if you're thinking about doing a little, you know, quick water skiing uh, before dinner, don't do it just yet. It's going to get wet out there, okay? Now, we've got a couple of lines going on here. First line here and then kind of a secondary thing that's back in Canada right now and that's a lot closer to the actual front that's going to go through. So this is kind of a, a precursor to what may happen a little bit later on. We're not expecting anything severe or anything like that, but just be aware that if you're going to be out and about, especially later on tonight, grab the umbrella. You're going to be glad that you did that. A lot of 80s on the weather map, places like Derby and Jay and Morrisville, 90 in Burlington, but Wilmington where white face is 85 degrees and look at Saranac Lake where there has been some rain around quite a bit cooler. Now, here's the deal. If you are heading out, we're looking good for a little while here, but we're going to keep the chance for some showers and maybe a couple of thunderstorms in the forecast kind of on again, off again through, say, the early overnight. Otherwise, we're going to be good, set up really nicely for what looks to be a pretty terrific day tomorrow. And trust me when I say it's going to feel way better. Maybe you're going to the beach. It's a south to southwest wind at 10 knots or less. Waves, not much of a big deal. UV index, that is a big deal. It's a burning kind of day, 78 that is the water temperature. It has been so warm in the water this year. So the air temperature, we go into the 80s from the 70s. Mentioned that, just a few clouds around, but I think we end up with a beautiful day. The wind is going to be light and the humidity levels are going to be down. But we need to get there first. So this is Futurecast, 730, a little over an hour from right now. We've got kind of this line that is making its way through few rumbles of thunder, I think most likely. Here comes your tomorrow. Any clouds first thing in the morning giving way to a decent amount of sunshine. It's going to be nice. Humidity levels dropping some throughout the day, so stickiest in the morning. Tomorrow night, it's no worries there at all. And Thursday, looking good. We end up with a lot of sunshine again. We will be on a roll once this stuff tonight gets out of the way. So scattered showers and storms, seeing it on the weather map right now. Most of us in the 60s, it is going to be muggy one more time here tonight. And then it becomes mostly sunny tomorrow. Some of us seeing just a few clouds around first thing tomorrow morning. Temps in the 80s, like 88, Lebanon, Springfield, 87 in Burlington, Plattsburgh. We will call it 86. So talk about a roll. Check this out Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. We're in the 80s all these days and really mid 80s right into the weekend. What a great stretch of days to have off. Maybe you could play at the lake. Monday, Tuesday, a few showers around. Then it's back to pretty nice stuff, but generally a little bit cooler. Upper 70s to the low 80s.